Iran is a predominantly Muslim country. More than 95% of the population of Iran are Muslims. In fact, Islam is Iran's official religion. In addition to Islam, people from other faiths have also been living side by side Muslims in Iran for hundreds of years, such as the Christians, the Jews and the Zoroastrians. But that's not all Iran has to offer in terms of ethnic and cultural diversity. And believe me when I say, this is one of the rare cases which has remained very much unnoticed until today, even in its own neighborhood. Hello. Hello, sir. How are you, Mr. Rosie? Fine, fine. Very nice to see you. Thank you. Thank you very much. This is thank you for you. Cover your head with this. All right. Thank this you. Motion. Thank yes. you very much. What did you say his name was? Uh, this is Patka. Patka. Yes. All right. Thank you. You should cover your head. Oh, I see. Okay. Uh, in fact, we have been given exclusive access to this place, and I will have a lot to show you inside this building. So follow me. This is the Sikh temple or the Gurdwara situated in the heart of the Iranian capital Tehran. In order to arrive inside the temple, everyone must cover their heads as a sign of respect. In a few hours from now, many Sikh families will gather here in a reunion in order to take part in a special religious ceremony. The Sikhs of Iran are to some extent a closed community. When it comes to exposing their personal lives and rituals, to other people. I guess I was the only person who has ever had the chance to report from inside their temple in Tehran. Sikha dar Iran kabl az 1947 ki Pakistani wujud na bud, marz Hindustan zahidan bud. As Punjab as tawasat rae zahidan be Iran amdan ve chun inja amniyat didan shuru be kasb kardan ve sabke ma dar Iran they had selected one person among themselves to speak to us. Sardar Hanam Singh Anand has been to Iran for 60 years. He's a successful businessman, but he also considers himself as a servant in the Gurdwara. For Sikh men, wearing a special turban and growing an everlasting beard is a tradition. Sikh women usually wear a modest traditional Indian dress, which is of course very colorful, in addition to a veil. The biggest Sikh gathering is held on the last Friday of every month in the Christian calendar. That is when the temple turns into a Sikh social club, where many families gather for social interaction in addition to prayers. It is a good opportunity for everybody to stay connected with their roots and customs. Some members of the community usually volunteer to help out with the reception. That includes working in the kitchen, baking bread, washing the dishes and serving food to the guests. Iranian mara dostaran, mam Iranian dostarim va ma chun inja kablan zindagi mikonim va inja dostarim va adat kardim digar in vatan ma hisab mikonim va ma inja امنیت همه چیز خیلی راضی هستیم از کشور از دولت و هیچ نوع مشکلی ما نداریم For many centuries different ethnic groups and tribes migrated to Iran 
They stayed here, cherished it, and later considered it as their motherland. They gradually turned into an inseparable part of Iran itself. I'm Amir Meti Kazemi. See you next time in Iran.